Hello, this is my mom, Carol, and uh, she has something to say. <laughs> so I'm Nathan's mom, and I've been blessed to be a part of this church since way before all of you were born. And um, so it's very exciting to see our son take uh, follow the footsteps still of being a worshiper. And his dad and I are very blessed to see him musically inclined and being a great big brother to his two younger boys, brothers that are coming up to WSU. So, amen. I'm Natalie, and this is my amazing mom, Kathy. I don't know what, how to start with her. She's blossomed so much in this church and over here in Pullman, and that's all her dad and I prayed about sending her to college was her walk with God and I she's been such an amazing role model to her sister she comes home and they can see the growth and how the fire of Jesus in her heart and it's just been such a blessing and it's actually her growth has made our whole family grow and it's amazing we just appreciate this church so much so thank God for it every day <laughs> Hi, I'm Colin. This is my mom, Dorothy. Hey, he's a great kid, and he's always been interested in science. So I remember a science fair project once when he decided to use his brother's hamster in order, <laughs> in order to check out as, as far as the number of times the hamster would turn right or left in the maze. And we'd had Brownie the hamster for quite a while, and uh, Colin did such a great, thorough job that he had great statistics. But when he woke up the next morning, Brownie gone to be with the Lord. <laughs> Hi, my name is Anna, and this is my beautiful mom, Joy. Well, our name for Anna is Awesome Anna, and I'm sure if you've been around her for very long, you know why we have picked that name out for her. <laughs> um, yes, we're really happy that she's here, and um, we thought we were sending her to Wazoo, but actually we sent her over here to CCF. It's like <laughs> she spends more time here than she does at school, but we're not complaining. We think it's awesome. We, we love all you guys. We pray for you guys. And um, let's see, something funny about Anna. We're so happy that, yes, we are taking her home for the summer. And um, <laughs> no, she's willingly coming home for the summer because she has two younger brothers that she has to whip into shape because her feet are uh, legally registered with the police as weapons, so beware. <laughs> Hi, my name is Lane Kemp, and this is my mom, Anita Hunt. I'll save the embarrassing stories. Um, Thanks. I don't, I, don't, I don't care. That's all right. <laughs> <laughs> I think the thing that I most appreciate about, appreciate about Lane um, is his heart. And the fact that he is never embarrassed to be seen with his parents or give his mom a hug or his stepdad a hug in public. Um, and I just want to thank Amy, wherever Amy is, that had the bottle of water the first week of school. Amy Ratliff. Where is she? Right there. There she is. Amy had a bottle of water when Lane was a very thirsty young man walking on campus. And our prayer for him, I mean, I, I echo the prayers of other mothers and fathers, was to find a church family and a solid place to put his feet, and he certainly did, and we are very blessed by that. Hi, my name is Rachel Ullman, and this is my mom, Marty Ullman. Hi. Rachel's given us, her dad and I a lot to be proud of. We're really excited that she's been able to be here, and especially here. And one thing that I thought of when you asked for a little story is when she was about four, her cat went missing, and she made a poster, and it said the cat's name was Snowy, and she said, please look for Snowy. And then she asked me for a picture, and we didn't have any pictures of the cat. So she drew a stick figure cat and figured that was good enough, and people would recognize it. <laughs> Thank 
Hello, my name is Nicole, and this is my amazing mom, Jackie. Um, I would say when Nicole came over here, I'm very proud of her that she became involved in the church and came to know God. And so that I'm very proud, but I really feel lucky because Nicole and I have, since the second she was born, been very close, and I feel that that gets stronger every year. So. This is my mom, Debbie. She came a whole two blocks to see you all. That's right. <laughs> Almost as far as Pastor Carrie. You know? <laughs> Carrie is my first daughter. And the one thing I really appreciate about Carrie is she will drop anything for a friend in need or even just a friend who needs chocolate. But um, <laughs> she's got a ready ear, and she very, very much cares for people. And she's really, really intuitive, and she has a deep love for God. Although, if you're going to talk to Carrie, you need to have a really good background on chick flicks <laughs> and Jane Austen, because she will talk to you in movie lines and book lines. And so unless you're literate, you're going to have a hard time tracking with her. So <laughs> but if you can talk the lingo, it works really well. <laughs> My name is Jaren Tilson, and this is my mother, Christy, and she wants to tell you a terrible story. <laughs> I should have brought the picture we have of Jaren when he was six. <laughs> His sisters made him wear a dress. <laughs> you, can, you can see it on MySpace. 